walking history tour downtown Memphis has everyone looking down. A native Memphian who has lived and worked in downtown for more than 30 years is kicking off something that he hopes will become a tradition. Fox 13's Lauren Johnson joins us live in the studio with this story. Lauren? Merle and Steve, Jimmy Ogle can count on his fingers the handful of places he's worked in Memphis, and most of them have happened to have been somewhere downtown. And many of his jobs have required him to be up on history. Well, now he's taking his experience, his knowledge, and his appreciation for art and bringing them together, hoping to share with his neighbors. Dozens wait at Union and Riverside for lunch with this man, Jimmy Ogle. Hello. Hello. Welcome. <laughs> the self-proclaimed historian keeps his notes close but can spout off historical tidbits like the street widening ordinance of 1922. The streets were too narrow. You had the advent of automobiles, so the city had an ordinance, street widening ordinance, 1952, uh, 1922. Okay. He points out downtown's oldest office building and along the entire tour, his attention focuses down. Now, I estimate there's about three or 4,000 different manhole covers in downtown, but I think there's about over 200 different kinds. Living downtown back in the late 1990s, Ogle grew fond of the ornamental street art. The manholes are the attraction. It's really kind of fascinating, and they're very beautiful. But it's really about the history packed into four city blocks. This is the oldest office building in downtown Memphis. And I think a lot of Memphians take our city for granted, the great history. The lunchtime tour is the first of its kind. Ogle suggested it to the Center City Commission's Downtown Alive project, an effort to make downtown a classroom for culture. I think this is the most, one of the most famous stretches of streets in our city because our city started here at the river. It's free, it's quick, after you get done you can go have a bite to eat. It's, yeah, it's a great way to spend the middle of the day. Shuffling down Union, the group pays close attention to Ogle's quirky, fun, and interesting lease on downtown life. Grateful to learn a little more about the place they call home. I never noticed that downtown there are no power lines above. He just mentioned that. That's what all the manhole covers do is connect everything underground. Connecting pieces of the past, one manhole at a time. Now, Ogle says he hopes to do the tour again, so stay tuned. To find out more about the Downtown Alive series and to get a calendar of events, log on to our website at myfoxmemphis.com and click on the Scene on TV link. Live in the studio, Lauren Johnson, Fox 13 News.